Hello folks, Ron Whitmire here. Today we're going to talk about how to protect your hands on a construction site. Now OSHA requires that employers provide their employees with personal protective equipment, which includes safety gloves. The employer must provide the PPE, as it's called, and pay for it. Now it can actually be challenging to make sure you've got the right glove to protect you against the job you're doing. Now here are some factors that are involved in choosing the right glove. What are the types of chemicals that you'll be handling if you're handling chemicals? And are you simply coming in contact with those chemicals or are you immersing your hands into chemicals? What are the grip requirements uh, that you have in the job you're performing? Some gloves uh, have very good grip resistance and others uh, not as well. Do you need heat protection? Are you uh, exposed to different abrasion uh, type uh, hazards? And then of course, the size and comfort of the job. You've gotta be able to do your job uh, with the gloves on. There's four types or groups of safety gloves, and they protect against different exposures or different hazards. So the first is leather or canvas or metal mesh gloves. Now these are designed to protect against abrasions and cuts. Fabric or uh, plastic coated fabric uh, gloves, those are designed to protect against abrasions and then with a, a plastic coating on the uh, inside of the glove or on the hand part of the glove. Um, that's designed to give you extra grip strength. And then there are chemical resistant gloves and insulating rubber gloves. So for the chemical resistant gloves, they are made out of a variety of substances like neoprene, latex, uh, butyl and nitrile, and they each uh, perform a little differently. Uh, so what you need to do is look at the manufacturer's recommendations of what that particular glove is designed to protect against um, and what maybe it doesn't protect so well against or very well at all. And also uh, OSHA has a, a chart from the uh, Department of Energy that lists those four types of uh, plastic or rubber type gloves and how well they perform in uh, protecting your hands against various types of chemicals. Another thing that's very important with safety gloves is the proper care and maintenance of the, those gloves because they can become damaged. They can be torn, punctured, uh, and then no longer provide the protection uh, that you need. And with those uh, rubber type gloves, uh, a way to check to see if they've been punctured is to fill them with water, uh, take the uh, open end and roll it toward the fingers and you'll be able to see whether there are any even pinhole uh, size punctures in that glove. And uh, if so, discard the glove, get some new ones because you need that glove to protect you against the chemicals uh, you're dealing with. Folks, thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, feel free to shoot me an email and please stay safe and be well.